All right, first and foremost, I'm going to say all praises be to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem Rakah Kodash. And then I'm going to say double honors to the apostles and elders of great most honor, Shalom to the sincere elect, he's in the truth and faith and sincerity. Quick topic I want to speak on, you know, uh, is um, based upon what it says in uh, in, in Second Timothy's uh, chapter 2 and 4, but it's spiritual because the whole, whole the whole lesson is based around enduring hardness, you know, adversity. And this is the third time I tried to do this this video, man. You know, it's crazy. You know, like I, I like I just finished like a thirty minute video. You know, I, I I was I was pretty sure to check that it was you know recording the sound, but you know I was using a, a different uh device I don't normally use and yeah just just didn't record the sound so you know I'm, I'm gonna do it again tip number three all right but um you know really the point I, I really wanted to focus on anyway was um that there's there's a reason why the, the scripture says here in verse four like the lord has have 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 chosen us to be a soldier there's a reason why that's that's written that he has chosen us to be a soldier that means the path that we're on this truth if we be of the lord's elect it's not meant to to be be, be anyway kind of easy man of course you know things take place in seasons you know like as we see in the scriptures with our lord when he was when he was dealing with satan the scripture says that satan left him for a season Right, so at times, you know, there are times where, you know, it's it's you know everything is you know you you are just going through all different times that types of hell, and it just feels it feels like it won't stop, and then and and then, and there's other times where it's not as much, but you know, either way, we we do go through like adversity. You know what I mean? But there's a reason why it says he's chosen enough to, to, to be a soldier, man. Because if we're we, we of the elect, that means we've been chosen from the foundation of this world to, to get mercy. But but also chosen from the foundation of this world to, to go through trials and tri tribulations and suffer for this truth. And then, like in the end of it all, get mercy. All right. So with that, I'm going to start from, you know, just read these, these couple of scriptures. All right. All right. This is uh second Timothy chapter two, verse one and down. Now, therefore, my son, be strong in the grace that is in Hamashiach, Yahweh Shai. And it's, and it's powerful because grace, mercy is, is basically the same thing. Right. You know. Like, you know what I mean? It's like, even here it says, all right, um, in point two, right, it says, of the merciful kindness by which the, the Most High exerting his holy influence upon souls turns them to Habashai, keeps, strengthens them, and increases them in the um, Christian faith, which we, we you know we we have the true truth, man, right? Faith, knowledge, affection, and kindles them to the exercise of the the uh, you know the, the the Christian virtues, which really is we we have the the, the true uh, truth, man. Right, so it says, um, and the, the things that thou has heard of me among many witnesses, the same commit thou to faithful men who shall be able to teach others also, which is what we're actually doing, man. Because at the end of the day, the actual scripture says, take heed unto the word which is able to save your uh, souls man so that's why we're actually pushing forth this faith the scripture says that this 
the gospel shall shall be preached throughout the, the world for a witness unto all nations, and then shall the end come. And that's why it's important for us to teach this truth. It's important for us to teach and push forth this faith, man. All right. Thou therefore endure hardness. Now, if you go into the word for endure, hardness is kakopathio. And it's spiritual because, you know, like how it's written. You know what I mean? It also contains the um, word path, man. You know, so this path that, that we're on, right? Like as it speaks about in second like Ezra's like in order to get to this city this kingdom which is uh builded we we have to go through what the straight gate man right which this path comes of trials tribulations and many fold you know what i mean adversity man but but you know what what the scriptures say if he that enjoyed for to the end, the same shall be saved, man. So it says, um, to be afflicted, to endure afflictions, hardness, to suffer, endure evils, hardships, to be afflicted, man. As a good soldier of how was shy. It's interesting if you go to the word for soldier, right? It says uh a it says uh a, a here it says a, a camper out you know which is spiritual because every week that's what we what would you say you know why she can going out there to hold camp a uh, it says a warrior which spiritually that's 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 what we obviously are right because because Ephesians 6 speaks about that you know what I mean you know what I mean all of the spiritual fights and and battles that we have to you know what I mean go through man and endure so, 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 so whatever it's that's you know spiritual mental you know even in the flesh man like there's brothers in his faith that before they came to this truth, they had a better health. But in the faith, even though we um you know eat the the best that we obviously can, we uh you know don't eat pork and we take certain herbs and supplements and stuff. You're just still going through hell, man. But even though we feel it in the flesh, really, like it's also like a spiritual uh, fight. And if you go to point two, it says a ch ch champion of the cause of Yahweh Shai. And, and, and that's what we obviously are. That's why we're out there pushing forth the truth. We're out there pushing forth his name, man. All right. No man that warreth entangleth himself with the affairs of this life that he may please him. Who have chosen him to be a soldier. And, and that's the point I wanted to focus on. Right? He have, he have chosen us to be a, a, a soldier. So that basically means if we be a, a, the Lord's elect, that means we've we we we've been, we've been been chosen to suffer. We've, we, we, we've also been, been chosen to endure. And we've also been chosen to get mercy, man. You know? That's why it's better to... to, to to, to 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 suffer for for the, the path of, of 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 righteousness than to to suffer as an evil doer you know moses went through the diverse trials and tribulations but but by that path he was on was much better than to you know to to you know uh, 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 be be called the the, the the son of Pharaoh, and to to you know uh it, like to, to to enjoy the pleasures of sin. 
for a season, man. You know? So this is uh, Acts... Um, this is the book of Acts 14 and, and 22. It says, The confirming the souls of the disciples and exhorted them to continue in the faith and that we through much tribulation enter into the kingdom of the most high so we through much tri tribulation and we must right we must through much not not you might through a bit you know it says we must through much tribulation enter into the kingdom of the most high so, so that's why that you know uh, uh like i believe is a quote if i'm not mistaken by bruce lee Oh, where it says, give me not the strength, and uh, sorry, give me not an easy life, but give me the strength to endure a hard one. Because if we keep it real, the, the, the a scripture says that what we are going through in this time is not going to even compare to the um, glory and to the... Um, reward that we we, we 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 shall get you see that's why it's important for, for us to you know pray for more faith and pray to endure you know but, but you know the point i wanted to focus on was hey he he, he, he the, the, there's a reason why he actually says that he has chosen us to be a soldier he's chosen us to, to suffer he's chosen for us if we are his elect to to, to, to endure all right and hey, that that basically means that if we are of the elect, then then, then 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 we've essentially been chosen from the foundation of this world to get mercy, man. All right. So with that, you know what? Man? I'm gonna end with um second Andrew two and forty five. You know, um, really, I just wanted to focus on second Timothy two. But hey, spirit, this is um. Uh, second Ezra two and forty two. I, Ezra saw upon the Mount Mount Zion a great people, whom I could not number, and they all praised the Lord with songs, and in the midst of them there was a young man of high stature, taller than all the rest, and upon every well, one of their heads he set crowns and was more exalted, which I marvelled at great greatly. The scripture says, or well, every one of their heads he set crowns. All right, so I asked the angel and said, "Sir, what are these?" He answered and said unto me, "These be they that have put on the mortal <laughs> proven and put on the immortal, and have confessed the name of the Most High." Which is why, you know, if you meet a, a camp that says, "Oh, the, the Lord's name don't matter," we can call him anything we want. Then you, 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 you have to look at that guy sideways, man. Because those names must be confessed. And what did you say? Now they crown and receive palms. And palms is, is, is a representation of victory. Then said I unto the angel, What young person is it that crowned them and gave them palms in their hands? So he answered and said unto me, It is the son of the Most High, whom they have confessed in the, the world which which to, you know the fact that we, we, we have to confess him right and stand stiffly f f f for his name that means that we face uh, um that we face opposition against it which even proves that the lord's her name ain't no christ and jesus be, be, because even a, like a Muslim, a Satanist, a fucking atheist and such, all three of them can, can you know, if you ask them what the Lord's name was, that's what they'll say, it's Christ. So even that alone proves that the Lord's name can't be that man. Because when we confess the true name, we f face opposition against it, man. Oh, you guys don't have the, 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 the Hebrew and blah, blah, blah. Right? Like dudes, dudes like vocab. 
All right, so you answered it and down to me, it is the son of the most high whom, whom they have confessed in the world. Then began I greatly to commend them that stood so stiffly for the name of the Lord. So yeah, kind of, man, you know, it was just a quick video, quick point I wanted to speak on. And I hope, it, 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 you know what I mean? I hope that like it was edifying. So with that, I'm going to say, well, praises be to Yahweh, Bashmael, Shai, Bashem, Rakakudash. Double honor to the apostles and elders, great most to next time. I'm going to say, Shalom.